What's up, Geeing fam? Welcome back. Hope you guys are having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for being here. If this is your first time visiting the channel, welcome. My name is Dennis. It is a pleasure to have you. So we're back with Mr. Oliver Anthony. He's released another video, another song, I Want to Go Home. Looks like we're here in the same place as we were for Richmond, north of Richmond. That song really took off, had a strong message that millions of people have uh, have related to. Um, so now we got another one. I feel that now that everyone knows who Oliver is, everyone knows Oliver's voice, his stance on things, anything he releases, I think people are going to, uh, going to check it out just to hear what he's got to say. He's a strong dude, not afraid of his stance, not afraid to say what's on his mind. I want to go home. I wonder what this one's about. Let's find out. Before we get started, please make sure you subscribe to the channel, hit the like button, make sure notifications are turned on. You do not want to miss out on future reactions. We're on the road to 200K. We are less than 13,000 subscribers away. So if you've been watching uh, in the shadows, step into the light, click subscribe, join the King fam. Let's grow. In the description box below, you'll find links to all of our social media. Please check those out. Maybe even give us a follow and drop your comments in the comment section. Tell me your thoughts on the message behind, I want to go home. So without further delay, let's change the screen. I'm going to grab my headphones. I've been battling like some sinus issues, man. It's been rough over here at the house. So I'm going to pause for one moment. All right, we good to go now. Let's go. I want to go home. Well, if it weren't for my whole dogs and the good Lord, <laughs> they'd have me strung up in the psych ward. Okay. Because every day living in this new world, one too many days to me. Okay. Okay. So if it wasn't for his dogs and the good Lord, he'd been gone crazy in this world right now. Okay. He started off a little bit lower. Mm -hmm. world. One too many days to me. <laughs> Son, we're on the brink of the next world war, and I don't think nobody's praying no more, and I ain't. Saying I know it for sure I'm just down on my knees Begging the Lord and take me home Man, I like how he had the, the internal and external rhyming schemes there That was kind of like how rappers do things The way he did the rhyme schemes there That was really cool I, I dug that So, basically, it's, it's getting worse and worse And Lord, just take me home at this point Alright, let's keep going I love his voice, man He's killing this On my knees Begging the Lord and take me home. That was nice. Ooh. I want to go home. Look at the pup in the background. I don't know which road to go. It's been so long. I just know I didn't used to wake up feeling this way. Cussing myself every damn day. There's always some kind of bill to pay. People just doing what the rich man say. I want to go home. Want to go home may be an ode to going back to the way things were. A simpler time, an easier time to live, maybe. Or, Lord, call me home. Could be double entendre there. Uh, it, 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 who's doing better now than they were a couple years ago? But be honest. Who Who's doing better now? than you were doing three years ago in terms of finances and money and being able to raise your household. Well, maybe I shouldn't say three years because that was during lockdowns. So that was kind of rough four years ago. Man say, I want to go home. Farm in the ground, grandson sells to a man out of town, and two weeks later, the trees go down. Yep. Only got concrete growing around. Yeah, developers. Home. Back to a simpler time. I want to go home. I don't know which road to go. It's been so long. Don't we? I just know I didn't used to wake up feeling this 
way. Yeah. Cussing myself every damn day. People have really gone and lost their way. They all just do what the TV say. I want to go home. Yeah. We are in a place where people have lost their ability to free think. We just, a lot of people, not everybody. I think a lot of people are starting to wake up to this, but a lot of people over the past few years, I'd say over the 10 years, really since like social media has come out, since social media has come out, there is this, there's this thing where people, especially celebrities and influencers are guiding people to go in certain directions, in a particular direction and to think a certain way. Um, and in doing that, you lose your individuality. You lose your your ability to formulate your own ideas, do your own research, come up with your own method of living, your own way of living. You just kind of go along with the crowd. Sometimes you don't even know it. You're just you're just rolling with the punches. Um, that's why you got to be you got to be careful for what you're looking at. Got to be careful for you know about what you're listening to. You know, there's that old song that people used to you know, that people sing to kids in Sunday school. It's like, "Be careful, little eyes, what you see. Be careful, little ears, what you hear." You you, you have to pay attention to that. You you have to have discernment of what's the right way to go. What's the you know what's the wrong way to go? What's good? What's evil? And I don't mean earth's version of good and evil like what's real good what's real evil come on oliver take it home i saw an interview where he said he doesn't think he can sing or play very well i think he plays pretty good and i like his voice he's did a slide up from the deep voice in this if one for my whole dogs and the good lord they'd have me strung up in the psych ward Dun, dun, dun. There's the pup there. Hey, puppers. For what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul? I don't want to gain the whole world and lose my soul. That's that Toby Mac, which Toby Mac and Mandisa, which y'all know about that. Yeah, man. It's true. It's so sad. This is where we are. So sad. This is where we are. Um, I like that Oliver be, is becoming a voice of the people and um, not afraid to stand up and say his, his, his stance. I, I love the boldness in a world where you are pretty much canceled for saying stuff like this. I'm glad to see that this gentleman has gotten a lot of uh, support from around the world. Um, not just here in the U.S., but around the world like that. Richmond, north of Richmond. I see many comments. I saw many comments that talked about this isn't going on in just your country. It's going on in insert country, like our country. Fill in the blank. Um, really awesome. Really, really awesome that uh, Oliver uh, has a stance and he's not afraid to stand up to it. Not afraid to stand up for it. Um, Want to go home, go, you know, a simpler time. Back to the way things used to be. Um, I like how he said things, uh, how he says something like fourth generation farm or something like that. A fourth generation farm. Um, grandson, great grandson sells it to a man from out of town. It's not even from here. Next thing you know, the trees are down. They're developing it, pouring concrete, putting up a factory, shopping mall, something like that. Um, that loses individuality because that independent farm, whatever it is, whatever it is that you're producing, um, a, a corporation is going to fill in that gap. Um, and as long as the corporations that are part of all of this funnel, as long as other ones running things, man, like it's, it, it, there's no such thing as small business. Like it's all corporations that are doing this now. Um, you know, I'm not a small business owner outside of YouTube, so I can't really speak on it at all. But um, it's 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 really crazy to see what's going on right now. As much as I can, I try to buy local here in, in my area. I want to support the local economy. Um, I don't want to keep giving money to corporations. But anyway, this was awesome. You know, um, for him to say that he doesn't feel like he can sing or play very well. Um, I hadn't seen you just really get down on the guitar, man, but 
for what you're doing, you're getting the point across. So you're doing, you're doing just fine where you are, my dude. And uh, once again, Oliver, thank you so much for taking your stance and, and being another voice of the people. There are several, several artists out there that, that are the voice of the people. Thank you for standing up and being a voice for the people. So if you guys enjoyed my reaction, please make sure you subscribe to the channel. Hit the like button. Make sure notifications are turned on. You don't want to miss out on future reactions. We are on the road to 200K, so come be part of the fam. Step out of the shadows, into the light. Click subscribe, and let's grow. In the description box below the video, you will see links to all of our social media. Please check those out. Maybe even give us a follow and drop your comments in the comment section. I want to know what you think about Oliver's I Want to Go home back to a simpler time lord please call us home whatever you think it is tell me what you uh tell me your thoughts in the comment section i hope that you guys have had a wonderful week me and my family have been we've been battling some sickness around here so i haven't been up uploading it all this week today is the first day i've uploaded since last friday but um we're all we're all feeling better we're all doing good uh so thank you guys for coming i hope you and your family are doing well also once again thank you for taking a small a portion out of your day to hang out with me watching Oliver. I greatly appreciate each and every one of you. Check out videos from earlier today. There will be more videos tomorrow, so on and so forth. Please keep coming back. Once again, thank you so much. I will see you soon on the next one.